<clears throat> Yo, what is going on? Hope you guys are having a great fucking day today, okay? I'm going to show you guys my trade that I took today, and I want you guys to let me know if I'm having a good day, okay? Let's see. Oh, there it is. Am I having a good day? No. Now, I lost another fucking trade today. Man, this entire week has been shit for trading. But let me break it down. So, I had this candle here. Had this candle here. Both creating equal lows. I was like, damn, dude. Shit's going to get swept. Okay. And then if I see an, a reversal to the upside after having such major down momentum, it surely has to go up. So, had a break. Okay. Let's go down to the one minute. Break happened somewhere over here. Kept going down. Created this fair value gap here to here. And this very small fair value gap here to here. Price kept going up. Came down into my fair value gap range. Broke structure here. And I tried. I mean, it wouldn't fucking matter. But I tried buying like right here. But I was a little late. So I ended up buying uh, right at this range. Uh, price, price kept going up. Came down. Came into my fair value gap again. And again. Went up. Came back down and just shit on me. Um, I think what is happening, to be 100% honest, I think I'm putting my fucking targets way too loss. Or it's way too big. Like a fucking 50 pip stop loss. And a 300 pip fucking target. No. That's fucking dumb. Okay. So I lost another trade. I was right a little bit. Of price going up more after this fair value gap. I'm wondering if. Can I. I'm wondering if. If I would have seen this. No. I, I, I still like my trade right. If I was able to enter. Here. And then. Let's see. Maybe target. Like this level here. Yeah that would have been a 2 to 1. Off of. This level here, maybe taking partials on the way up. I don't know. Maybe I need a. Maybe I'm getting a little too ambitious with my take profits, and I need to uh, maybe lower my stop loss. My problem is, is I don't want to get hit. I don't want to get hit by fucking spread. Spread is like price comes down here, but then I could get taken out. It, it's dumb, man. Real. Real trading compared to fucking like uh, uh, back testing trading are two different things, right? Um, it is annoying, especially if I had like, if I was going short and this was my stop loss up here and price came up to here, it'd probably take me out and I would lose. Even though it never hit, I would probably still lose. It's, it's fucking dumb and I'm still trying to learn that shit. Hmm, I wonder how I can fix this. Like, actually. Because I ended up buying way up here, which is the dog shit. Like, missing an entire candle almost. Because when I, when I buy, because I think I clicked buy around here, but then the computer fucking put my open price at 6 7 So, yeah. I need to... I need to be a little bit more quick, I think. Yeah. I think I just need to be... I, I need to be a little bit more tentative. And then I might get a little bit better of an execution. I think that's what I'll try next week. And uh, we'll see what happens. I'm going to focus on better stop losses. I mean, going off of this second fair value gap, I think, is fine. Right? But... Maybe go for a more reasonable take profit. Because uh, there's nothing wrong with a 2 to 1 ratio, right? If if you put $100 down for risk, you're gaining 200 There's There's nothing wrong with that. So, I think I just need to be... This, this upcoming week, 
more precise entries. Try and get in a little bit earlier to catch the move. Um, be patient and just better, better take profit levels, I would think. I think we can make that work. But yeah, hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And I will talk to you guys Monday if I end up taking a trade. Peace.